welcome to my channel or welcome back clairvoyant i am because i am clairvoyant i hope everybody's having a great day i am going to pull some cards on your love interest i'm going to do a love reading spirit show me the true honest accurate messages for the collective who's in love with my collective what does my collective need to know at this time? True, honest, accurate messages only, spirit. Uh-oh. Those flipped, but they did not flip out. I'm not going to take those. True, honest, accurate messages for the collective. Love interest. Show me the cards I need to see. Thank you. True, honest, accurate person in love three just came out I keep having threes come out in a lot of my reads true honest accurate messages true honest accurate messages spirit true honest accurate show me the true honest accurate messages for my collective love interest their love interest who's coming towards them okay shoe is that all spirit is that all is that all the messages True, honest, accurate. Okay. At the bottom of the deck, we've got the Ace of Wands. I've got Aries energy. Libra energy. Leo. Sagittarius. Virgo. And possibly some Capricorn. With the bottom of the deck, Aries. Somebody's ready to take action here. But someone is absolutely full of uncertainty. It's just what I'm getting here. Now, I'm not sure if this is your energy or someone around you. Um, but I feel like it's someone around you. I think they've been fooling themselves here or they're in a state of confusion. You may be feeling or they may be feeling emotionally detached or they're having some kind of trust issues going on someone doesn't trust a situation is what i'm picking up here or someone has been lying to you or lying to their self or trying to betray you or trying to manipulate you or control a certain outcome of a relationship here Someone is absolutely obsessing over you and watching you. They see how strong that you are. Your truth shines through is what Spirit is telling me. They hold you at a high standard. They know your value. They see your worth. They see you as a dream come true. You're this person's cream of the crop. You see all this wheat back here or under here <laughs> and this beautiful sunshine? Yeah, but you're standing in your power. And this person absolutely knows. And they hold you in high standard. They have you on a pedestal. They know that you don't need them. You don't need them at all. They know that you are just fine without them. This person feels like they don't meet up to your standards is what I'm getting here. Also, there's someone that can't stand you. They can't stand you. This is someone you know. Um, they can't stand that you always get your way. Is what spirit's saying you have god-given strength with this magician card and this empress 
or someone thinks that you're stubborn or you're too strong or you're a know-it-all or some shit like that. Um, but you're being offered a brand new beginning here. A brand new start. With the Ace of Wands at the bottom of the deck. This could be just a brand new love. And you're going to hear about it. But this person, you intimidate this person. I'm telling you right now. There's somebody that wants to come to you, but they don't know how. They're absolutely in love with you. But they feel like they can't support you physically and emotionally. Because, like I said, they hold you in high regards. You're the cream of the crop. They see the value and the worth in you. And I feel like this person, you intimidate them to the core. They feel as though you are too independent. I just heard Spirit say, you're too independent. Why, why do you need them? That's what I'm hearing. And my throat chakra is trying to close. Somebody absolutely does not want me to get this message to you. They see how strong-willed you are. This person sees you making your own money. You seem to have it all together. You're secure. You're very stable here. Well-grounded, well-balanced. You're very intimidating, not only to this person that's absolutely in love with you, but to other people as well. You're very intimidating. You're like your own boss, like your own CEO or some shit like that. And I can also tell you that the two of you, you have shared heart-to-heart -heart conversations. That's what I'm getting here. And the truth has been told as well to you. And you know, you know your heart. You see this heart right here? You hold your heart or you, or you wear your heart on your sleeve. That's what Spirit's showing me. And this person, oh my goodness, they, they listen to you. They feel all those warm, tingly sensations when they are near you or even just the mere sight of you causes sparks. Look at this. Causes sparks to fly. That's what I'm getting here. This person actually listens to you when you talk to them. And now they're ready. They're ready to come in and take this action towards you. But you are so intimidating to them. You are this person's sunshine. But you're making them so nervous. They can't control their own emotions. So they hide. They hide all their emotions for you inside of them. Yeah, because the knot of pentacles came out in reverse. This person is just unbalanced, unstable, not grounded here around you. But they want to take action and come towards you. Yeah, this is the way you actually make them feel. All tied up in knots. You know, just butterflies all in their stomach. They, they don't know what to do. You've got this person just all tied up in their own emotions that are absolutely hidden. So they're hiding. They're hiding this confession from you. They're emotionally detached. But they also, they have trust issues going on. Someone doesn't trust a situation anymore. They've been lying to their self. Or they're trying to control some other type of energy. It's just what I'm getting here. They they just they don't have any control over their own emotions because you're very intimidating. Like I said, they're used to having a codependent relationship. And you're just you're not. You're absolutely you're free. You do just fine on your own.
and this person they want it all with you look at this this is the page of wands like i said looky here the ace of wands and the page of wands <laughs> they have all these warm tingly sensations when they're near you even the mere sight of you causes these sparks to fly they want growth with you they want a new beginning i don't know if you've had this person in the past but they're ready to come back in and offer you this this brand new and you know what they're manifesting it as well i love you guys so much until your next read peace